What's going down, fight fans? This is Northwest Fight Team Spaniard, Tommy Leesman. We're here at the after party. We got some happy people here. Everybody's <laughs> partying, man. He's happy. He got a victory in the first round armbar. 133, I think, was the time over Carlos Rodriguez at Sport Fight 30. Man, that was a sick armbar. Um, talk about the fight and the transition into the armbar. Yeah, thank you, brother. Um, yeah, I got uh, ended up on top, and uh, he kind of scooped under me, and looked like he was going to go out the back. And, um, you know, he kind of got the top position, but he stuck his arm in there. So I just went for kind of a top side belly down arm bar and um, he rolled. So I just rolled with it, followed and was able to, to lock it in and um, heard a verbal submission. But uh, the referee was, you know, a few feet away. So I just continued to, to try to lock it up and the referee finally came in. I felt the hands from the third party and uh, that's when I let go. And um, yeah, I hope his arm's okay, but I had to do my job, and if it was either him or me, so but I'm really happy with it, and I uh, really appreciate Carlos for taking the fight and coming all the way down from Spokane. And now, you had a ton of fans there going, what was that like having all those people behind you? You know, I had a, a really good following in my last fight um, at Square Ring Promotions, July 29th, and that time it was pretty overwhelming, and I felt a lot of pressure, but this time I was able to kind of soak it up and enjoy it, I'm starting to get used to it. And I uh, just got so many friends and family that come out and support what I'm doing and um, hearing their cheers and stuff gives me a lot of strength and, and will to win. Um, you know, it, it was more of a family environment, so there were a lot of kids that I work with from the gym and, you know, just little cousins and, and nieces and nephews. And um, so that, that just kind of lights a fire under me and, and makes me want to win that much more. And knowing that they're there, um, you know, like my mom and the kids and stuff, um, makes it to where I'm going to do whatever it takes to win. So it brings out 110% Tommy. Now um, you fought at Sport Fight tonight, Sport Fight 30, which has had some historic UFC guys there, one of which you train with, Chael Sonnen. Um, what's that like to fight there in that environment, in that venue, um, knowing with some legends that have fought there? Man, such an honor to fight in Sport Fight. I've been following Sport Fight since I've been a fan of MMA. And, uh, you know, my, my number one inspiration and mentor Enoch Wilson has been the 145 pound champ there so I've been watching him shred it up for the last you know like four years as champion and um, it's just it's really cool and surreal to to be a part of that now and that was my first time fighting in sport fight and to have Chael there commentating and working there you know um, was really uh, really surreal and, and awesome I'm a big Chael Sonnen fan I get to train with him a lot um, I take my lickings from him and I really appreciate you know, everything that he does um, for me and pushing me and, and making me a better fighter. But, um, yeah, and then you got, you know, the media that's there, like Northwest Fight Scene. Um, I think it's phenomenal what they do. And, uh, you know, the fact that they're even interested in what I'm doing in my career is, is great. And, um, you know, media companies like that, what they do for the local fight scene is phenomenal. And on behalf of the fighters, I can't thank Northwest Fight Scene, take, take down media, Mass media, you know, all those media companies can't thank you guys enough because um, you guys take us to the next level, and that's why there's guys like Chael Sonnen, and you know, and, you know there's such a long list, and Chris Lee and Ed Herman, you know, Nate Corey, just guys that have come out of the Portland area that take it to the upper echelon of the sport. Um, and I think uh, we've got you know media companies like Northwest Fight Scene to thank for that. Yeah, well, we really appreciate that, brother, and we really love the wins that you keep piling up. Um, you got any other fights lined up? Uh, nothing scheduled right now. Um, probably uh, I'm gonna be training with Enoch. I think he's got a fight December December 9th. Um, United Combat Sports. Really looking forward to watching him get in there. He's looking really sharp. So I'm gonna help him get ready for that. And then uh, I'd like to do something at the beginning of the year. Uh, maybe catch the next sport fight. Something local. Stay local for a couple more fights. To try to build the record up a little bit. 2-0 now. I'd like to get up. You know, like eight, maybe eight more fights as a pro and then I'll start traveling around more and trying to get up into the, the upper echelon and try to get a big paycheck here real soon. Just got to keep winning and keep putting butts in seats. There you go. All right, man. Well, hey, congratulations again on the win tonight. Um, and we appreciate you taking the time to talk with Northwest Fight Team. Thank you very much, sir. We appreciate it. Thanks, Spaniard. Awesome. Appreciate it. NWFightScene.com. Thanks.